Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedia. Today we're going to be talking about the metronome basics in Studio One. Okay, so let's start. Um, if you've ever used a metronome before, you might know that some other uh, producers, engineers, and even some other digital audio workstations uh, might call them click. But uh, the words are interchangeable basically, metronome and click. So in Studio One, we're going to call it metronome. So where's a metronome and how do we use it? Well, if you're in your basic main timeline window where we are right now, you can go to your bottom uh, transport bar and there's an area where it says metronome. There's another area where it says tempo. These two are going to be linked and they're going to be very important for us. Um, another note here, tempo can also be interchangeable with the word BPM, beats per minute. Uh, you're going to see some digital audio workstations that call them BPM. Some others will call it um, Tempo, like Studio One. So, um, the first thing you want to know, how do you turn on your metronome? Well, there's this little triangle icon down here. It's grayed out right now. If you click on it, it turns blue, light blue. That means that it's on. So, if you press um, the play button, you should hear it. Also, if you record, you're also going to be hearing it. Another very important um, icon down here in the metronome area is this little circle down here. It's grayed out, which means that it's off. When you turn it on, it goes light blue. And this is the pre-count, okay, the pre-count option. This is totally optional. And what it does is that when you're recording uh, and you press the record button, you're going to hear a certain amount of measures or clicks before it actually starts recording. This is very useful when you're trying to get a feel of the tempo of the song before you start recording. Let's say that your song starts, uh, let's say you start recording an electric guitar on the first beat of the first measure of the song. Well, you might want to have a feel of the tempo before you start so that you that first strum actually hits that first beat of that first measure. So you'll use that pre-count um, for cases like that one. Uh, once again, it's totally optional. You don't need to use it if you don't want. Uh, you definitely want to make sure that your um, metronome is on on this little um, triangle button, which actually resembles a, a, like an old school uh, metronome, the ones we used to have on our, um, on our old pianos, right? Another very important area here, uh, which I mentioned before, is where it says tempo. You can see it says 150. 150 is talking about the number of beats per minute um, that this metronome is going to be playing. So 150 is considered, I guess you could say, a fast tempo. Let's say that your song is lower. Let's say it's 70. Uh, if you want to switch that, you can double click where it says 150, double click it, type 70, and then enter. And boom, there it is. Uh, your tempo now switched to 70. You can see that as soon as I did that, the grid lines here, or this um, this grid here, the spacing between these little grid marks is now bigger. Why did that happen? Because my tempo is now slower, which means that I have less beats per minute. If I go to a faster tempo, let's say 200, now they're closer to each other. <clears throat> um, so let's go ahead and test this. So my metronome is on because you can see that little triangle being light blue. It is totally on right now. So if I press the play button, I should hear it. We'll see what happens. And it does. So I'm going to stop it now. So that's how you, um, those are, so, sorry. So those were your metronome basics in Studio One, okay? You know how to turn it on and off. You know how to toggle the, pre-count and you know how to change um, your tempo. Another option that I forgot to tell you, or another um, function here, you can also tap the tempo. What do I mean when you want to tap the tempo? Let's say that you listen to a band, or let's say you're, you're rehearsing with your band and you have a song that you've written, you don't know exactly the tempo of the song. If you listen to the players um, playing the song, to the musicians playing the song, you can tap the tempo by simply clicking where it says tempo and the software will calculate the tempo of those clicks and will automatically set it 
to this to the song in Studio One. So let's go ahead and try that. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and click it maybe eight or ten times, and we'll see what happens. Click, 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 click. Oh, there it is. So it says automatically. It automatically, um, uh, I guess, evaluated or analyzed those clicks that I just did on top of the word tempo, and it turned that. It turns that those clicks are following a 91.49 um, tempo or BPM. That could be maybe 90. So what I typically do, I'll tap it, and if it says like 91.4, you know what? That's probably just 90. So I'll just double click it, type 90, enter, and that's it. That's how you tap your tempo. So those are your metronome basics in Studio One. If you have any other questions, please call us uh, of Obedia at 615 nine three three six seven seven five thank you very much you have a great day bye bye today's pro audio hardware and software can give you excellent results if you know how to use it properly obedia can help you to get the most out of your pro audio hardware and software why spend your time scouring the internet for answers or digging through manuals with one quick call to an Obedia technician, you'll be connected with someone who can give you the answers that you need in real time via phone and remote desktop. Obedia technicians are trained in all major digital audio applications on Mac, PC, iOS, and Android devices. Obedia member subscriptions are cost effective, give you great member benefits, and Obedia is here seven days a week to help you get the most out of your digital audio hardware and software. No matter what your level of expertise, Obedia can help you to stay focused and productive and get your music back on track. Start taming your technology today with Obedia.